Hey guys, welcome back to Drew Tutorial and in today's video, I'm going to show you how to delete all viruses from your Windows 10 or Windows 11 computer. Also, I want to advise that you stick around till the end of this video because I'm going to share with you a free software that you can install and this will also help you to remove or delete any viruses or malware on your computer. In addition to that, this can also help to boost your computer performance. So you'll definitely want to see and get this application. Now guys, the first thing that you want to do, head over to the Windows icon here on your taskbar and simply click on it and simply type run. Then you will see the run application. So you want to open up that and simply type in temp. Then go ahead and hit enter. And once you end enter, your temp folder will be there. So all that you see within this folder, you want to go ahead and click Control A and then just simply click delete, click continue and delete all of these files. Now, once you delete all of those files, you want to go back again and type in run again within the Windows bar. Open up the run and simply type in modulus temp modulus and simply click enter and you will receive also another folder just like this. Now for all of these files you want to simply go ahead and click delete, choose enter and simply delete all of these files that you will find within the folder. Everything that you can delete you want to go ahead and delete them from your folder. Right? The next thing that you want to do as well, go back to run again. You want to type in prefetch, simply open that, click continue. Once this is open, you want to go ahead as well and click delete and delete all of these files that you can within this folder as well. Now, once this is done, all you have to do is just simply click on the Windows icon again and type in disk and you will see the disk cleanup. Then you want to go ahead and open up this disk cleanup tool from within Windows. Now, what you want to do, you want to go ahead and select all of these as much as you can, even the recycle bin if you want to delete all of these recycle bin temp files temp folders you want to go ahead and select as much as you want once you select all the options that you want just simply go ahead and click clean up system files now once you click on this this will start to run the system files for you and then once this is done you can move on to the next step now the next thing that you want to do within windows is simply click on the windows icon and simply type in mrt and you will see the MRT there, just simply click on MRT. This is Microsoft Windows Malicious Software Remover Tool. So just go ahead and simply click on Next. Now, if you have time, you can simply do the full scan. Or if you don't have any time, you can simply run the quick scan. But I highly recommend the full scan. So what I'm going to do for the purpose of this video, I'm going to just simply select the full scan and leave it there. But in your case, you want to leave it to go through the full scan. And once this is done, you can simply close out. Now, I'm going to simply go ahead and cancel this because this is just a purpose for the tutorial. But you want to go ahead and simply allow the full scan to run as this will benefit you greatly. And as I said, guys, I'm going to share with you a very good software that you can install, which is free, that you can install on your computer that will delete all malicious files or software on your computer. Now, what you want to do is just head over to Google and type in Malware Bytes. Once this is open, you can open the Malware Bytes, which is the first option there. And here you can see that there is a free download. So you simply want to go ahead and download the free software. Now, once you download the free software, guys, you simply want to install the software here. And then you want to go ahead and allow it to scan. Once this is scanned, whatever malicious files that it finds, you will simply delete them then you want to go ahead and restart your computer. Once you restart your computer, you should notice the big difference in terms of the performance, in terms of the infection being removed from your computer, and this will definitely do a great job. Now guys, if you found some value within this video, I'd really appreciate if you give this video a thumbs up. And if you're new to the channel, special welcome to Drew Tutorial, I'm Andrew, and feel free to subscribe to see much more videos coming out every single week, just like this one. See you next time.